Hello, hello, hello. It's Key into here. You like you can call me Mrs. Key. And I just want to talk to you guys about this new business that I have started with Total Life Changes. Anyone who knows me knows I am all about whatever it is it's going to take to get you where you need to be and when i work with young people i always say we need to meet them where they are and take them where they need to go so hopefully as i meet you guys wherever you are in your car your living room uh work or wherever it may be that today i say something that will help you to get somewhere else that you're trying to go uh so i say that because um why why did i join this so i was very skeptical as with a lot of people about um the products about the people about everything <laughs> um so i dug 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 did a lot of research on total life changes to find out what they were about and it really is a community and products that you will feel um they are a plus and a better business bureau for all of those who really need those facts let me tell you google it look it up you will not be disappointed youtube it you will not be disappointed but i also don't want to leave you out so i tried the products for myself um from my sister favia and um at first i was only going to do the blossom me so i was only going to do blossom me because wow who wouldn't want to bless me um so anyhow i only did the blossom me because it was going to provide energy it was going to suppress appetite it was going to um balance hormones and oh my gosh who doesn't need a good hormone balance everybody does but then when she came over she brought me some nutribirds i'm like all right girl i'll buy it <laughs> and so then i bought it because i was like i don't that i got vitamins i got so many things because i was already up on well what is it that we really need right so i was already had like super green super fruits all this other type of stuff and i was like i don't need it <laughs> but since she came over i tried it hand y'all let me tell you it is not like any other um vitamin you have ever tried before it's really not i thought the same thing there were immediate changes it's a liquid vitamin and by like day two there were immediate changes where i was taking an allergy pill every day and i could feel the difference i could feel the difference in my throat and my nose because i also am a child who grew up with asthma challenges and stuff like that so i am very in tune to what is happening with my system and so when that when i had that and i'm like wait i haven't taken an allergy pill in like a few days like hold up wait how come i haven't felt what i've normally been feeling and i'm like oh my gosh that jag on nutribirds i said okay 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 it is definitely doing something different because i never had that experience with any other vitamins and nutrients that i was taking before and i didn't even know that at the time that one dosage is equal to 10 salads hello we're always trying to figure out how can we get all these nutrients that they say that we need in our bodies oh my god help and then i understood what it meant to have good gut health so that's the other thing that it does it definitely regulates your gut so a lot of people talk about heart health and they talk about liver liver health and they talk about mental health spiritual health physical health all of that but there is one part of health that i don't feel like i had enough inf information about and that is gut health it really is some people they even call it like your second heart um so if you're gonna guard your heart and you're gonna protect your heart then you gotta guard your gut and protect your gut because almost everything every challenge that i hear people talk about even if you're talking about high blood pressure if you're talking about cholesterol if you're talking about diabetes if you're talking about mental health if you're talking about spiritual health a lot of it challenges and solutions are found in your gut so you gotta put the good stuff in if you don't do anything else put the good stuff in so you're like all right i hear you i hear you this is why you did it but um what it ultimately was about because i am a root person so these to me are circumstances right these are circumstances 
that can help you get to the root of what you're dealing with, right? So what is the root? To me, the root is about making decisions for where you want to go. That's what it was about for me. I had things that I want to, wanted to accomplish. The quarantine got me all. Listen, I was perfectly fine. I don't mind having my stomach because it birthed my children. People can feel however they feel about it. Um, I do like to look nice in clothes and all that kind of stuff. So I would like it to, you know, be all put together and all that kind of stuff. But I don't trip. However, I could feel as I get older that I'm getting more sluggish. I'm getting more tired. I'm like, oh my gosh, I used to be a go-getter. Like I used to be in school, like knocking out papers. I done started organizations. I done directed organizations. I done give, 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 give. And I give for I give most of the stuff that I do for free because I just love it and I just know that God takes care of me. However, <laughs> I was like, something, something is happening. Something is not happening and I need it to happen. So I started to make decisions for where I wanted to go. Those decisions, first and foremost, started in my spiritual life. So I definitely got in my word more and I definitely got involved in my church more, not just from, I've always been involved in terms of programs and stuff like that, but I mean involved as far as my relationship with Christ and sharing my relationship with Christ because Ask my grandmother, she'll tell you, I was always in my room talking to God about something, right? Because I know that that's what gets me through. But um, I was not really good at sharing that part of my relationship with Christ to help others have a very deep relationship with God where you totally lean and depend on God for what it is that you need. And then God will move everything in your direction and your suddenly will come and your exceedingly will come and your abundantly will come. Um, but that starts with your obedience and your relationship in God. So I started to make decisions for where I wanted to go, right? And one of those decisions that I needed to figure out and make was how can I get my body to align with where my heart and mind was? How can I get my flesh under subjection to be able to do all the things that I wanted to do and I wanted to accomplish? So when I try these products and I'm telling you, I can write like I used to write. I could think like I used to think. I can put programs together like I used to put programs together. I could be everything that I'm used to remembering being that was uh it was slipping y'all it was slipping I was losing my grip a little bit I ain't gonna lie I was you know I was still moving and shaking because I know how to do that however when I came home I'm like oh something is different so from the inside out I wanted to make decisions for where I wanted to go and that's what I want you to do too the first thing that you have to do is cleanse yourself out so I'm not even going to go all over all of these today but what I am going to do is I'm going to tell you what I want you to do. I want you to either get the instant tea, support um, my business. Because some of y'all, y'all like, I don't even want it, but I love you. And I want to support you. Listen, I love you too. And you know, I support everything and everyone that I'm attached to. So if you are attached to me, I have most likely, most likely supported you before. Um, and so if you're like, that's all I want to do. Like, even if it were, it were, if it don't, it don't. I feel you, that's fine too. I either want you to get the instant tea or I want you to get the original tea. Why? Because I want you to clean your system out. That's what I want, simple. I want you to clean it out. Even if you have nutrients that you're taking in, a lot of us are still, first and foremost, if you say I eat healthy, guess what? You, If you live in Baltimore, you are breathe, you breathe in unhealthy air. <laughs> um, if you have furniture in your house, you have unhealthy chemicals in that furniture. If you clean your house with non-organic products and stuff like that, you have unhealthy chemicals in your house. And even though you're not eating it, you still breathe in that stuff. So it's still important to clean your body of toxins. And so once you clean your body of toxins, you will lose up to five pounds in five days. Now, if that is something that you need to do, you know you need to like let a little bit of weight go, then go ahead and do it. But the other thing that the tea does besides that, it gives mental clarity. It helps you stay focused. It helps you begin to gravitate and touch 
and fulfill all those things that you wanted to fulfill and then on top of that so a lot of people don't talk about this part they just want to lose weight but again i'm a root person i'm a source person so your gut you have to have good gut health so when you clean all that stuff out the truth is you have to put good things back into your body now i'm not gonna get deep but that's spiritual y'all that's real spiritual because when you drive things out when you drive out the enemy if you leave a space open and you do not fill that space with the goodness of the lord um then that enemy may come back and if you have a spot available for that enemy that enemy may come back and take up residence worse than it was before so although i am not proclaiming this to be connected in any kind of way to that i am giving you an analogy of how <laughs> it's, it's, it's a little deep y'all so you got to put good stuff back into your body so that your body can function the way that it's supposed to function on a daily basis all right so this is what i need y'all to do i need y'all to click my link i need you to support me supporting you and like i tell the young people that i work with at some point it has to matter more to you than it does to me because it is about your life it's about your decisions it's about you getting the healing that you need but i'm telling you i hear you i hear you i hear you so this is what i understand i understand that there are people connected to my breakthrough right everyone has people that are connected to them right and there are people that are connected to your breakthrough there are people who need you to shift because they know then you will bring them along to shift and or you will give to them what God has placed in you that is going to bless their life. So I understand that my breakthrough is connected to other people. So I am reaching out to you. And if this sits with your core values, if this sits with what it is that you need to do and what it is you need to accomplish, I am here for you to tell you make decisions to where you want to go. That's how you make decisions. All right. Everybody make decisions to where you want to go. You need a good support system. Anyone who has become successful will tell you that they had a support system. This whole self-made, there's no such thing. I don't even understand how that became a such a widespread acceptable term, but there literally is no such thing as self-made. So you had a support system. Anybody that's successful had a support system. But let me tell you something. Anyone that has failed has also had a support system. You did not fail by yourself. Everyone wants you to take on success and be excited. They want to be a part of your success and be like, don't forget me. Don't forget I did this. Don't forget I gave you that. And they want to say that, oh, when you're successful, don't say you did it by yourself. However, when you fail, they want you to take it all. Mm-mm. No one failed by themselves. There was a support system that helped you fail too. And sometimes that support system is what you're putting inside of yourself. So the only thing is you do have to be responsible for those things. Whether it's your success or whether it's your failure, there's a point where you have to be responsible for it, even though you didn't do it by yourself. And so once you do that, you start making decisions to where you want to go and you decide what is it that you're going to put into your system to support you better okay because at some point that's you taking responsibility for the system that either helped you be successful or helped you fail or has you stuck right and i want some people to get unstuck get unstuck with me i'm here to support you in all kinds of ways so it's not just about this we could talk we can dialogue let me tell you anybody that knows me will let you know that if you got something going on i can sit i can listen and i can get you through that thing with god helping me so click my link support me i'm trying to hit goals this makes me a little nervous everybody thinks that i'm outgoing and stuff like that and i'm actually kind of shy i'm really shy or i should say reserved all right and so this makes me a little nervous i was going to do it live but uh, uh i gotta look back at this thing <laughs> and decide whether i'm even gonna like post it or whatever and then if you guys like it show me some love if that's all you can do that's fine just show me some love show me some heart show me that little care heart 
and let me know if you think I should go live and really uh, break these things down. And I won't take as long the next time. I probably will be working on one product at a time. But let me tell you what I want you to get out of all of this. Either get the tea or the, and the Nutribers. Tea and Nutribers. Bye.